Another big story now, stunning new details. A report into the death of Tiverton firefighter Gerald Ledoux is released. Now, Ledoux died last August after suffering a heart attack during a water rescue. Now this new report says he was drunk with a blood alcohol level three times the legal limit. Eyewitness News reporter Alex DePrado joins us now with our top local story from Tiverton. Tiverton Fire Chief asked NIOSH for this report after Ledoux died here on Stafford Pond. The organization tries to prevent the deaths of firefighters. It concludes Ledoux had an alcohol level three times the legal limit when he came here to Stafford Pond to search for a missing boater. When Tiverton firefighter Gerald Ledoux jumped into Stafford Pond in August of 2008 to help find a drowning victim, this report by NIOSH concludes he was drunk three times the legal limit. It says his acute blood ethanol level was reported at 0.25 percent. Rhode Island law defines legal intoxication at 0.08 percent. 52-year-old Ledoux drove his personal watercraft to the site of the search for a drowning victim that summer day, put on his dive gear he owned, and got into the water against the advice of a lieutenant and fellow firefighter, according to the report. It says Ledoux, quote, attempted to perform the dive without fins and likely would have had difficulty being able to move any distance. Ledoux was found floating face down in the water a short time later, and the medical examiner ruled he died from probable cardiac arrhythmia in the setting of acute alcohol intoxication. The report goes on to say Ledoux's personal dive gear was in poor to fair condition and he didn't have enough training to participate in a dive rescue. Despite the findings, the Tiverton fire chief says, quote, firefighter Ledoux was doing something heroic. He died trying to save a life. He made a mistake. The report lays out 11 recommendations. Included in them are better trained divers and a zero tolerance policy for alcohol use while anyone is on duty. In Tiverton with the East Bay Mobile Newsroom, I'm Alex DePrado, Eyewitness News.